Hello everybody, or should I say, good evening, everyone. Tonight we are playing Mad Father. I just downloaded it a couple of minutes ago, actually. I don't know anything about it, I just know that it's a good game, you know, from the reviews. It got four and a half stars out of five, so it sounds good. So I think we're going to like it. So, in other words, let's get down to it. And the game is, like I said, Mad Father. Scenario illustration. Sen. Good artwork, I will say that. For the moon, a little creepy feel here. It's really setting the tone for the game. Wolf RPG editor. Like, I've really come to like a lot of the games that are made by the RPG editor. And so far, just this little bit that we have seen, it looks good. I like the, um, let me turn down. Yeah, I'll do that. I'm trying to get the volume and stuff just right. So that I can hear, you can hear, but also you can hear my words. And we come upon a very nice looking mansion. Is this where our mad father lives? I'm really loving this music. If I can find just the audio of this, wow. I'm so putting this on my playlist. Okay, if somebody out there can find the audio of this, give me the uh, like, like post the link down below or something like that. Because I would like to have this background for all my games. Awesome. Okay, sweet. So, I think this is one of the characters. Looks like we might be playing as a girl. A Japanese girl. Or American, I don't know. I mean, I'm going to say Japanese. I'm just going to go Japanese. Just for the sake of this video. Yeah. When is the gameplay going to start? Mad father! You forgot to capitalize the F there, people. But it doesn't matter. As long as the gameplay makes up for it. We won't hold it against you. Well, I won't. I can't guarantee my viewers will not. But I sure won't do it. They are really taking their time here on just... Oh, sweet. Okay, I was supposed to press enter. I could have been talking forever. Northern Germany. Drevis Residence. Father. Oh, nice. Sweet. Father, are you in there? Father? I, uh, how many times have I told you not to come down here? Oh, crap. Is that your father? He looks mad, of course. <laughs> Sorry, Father. But, um, I'm too scared to sleep on my own. Aya, don't worry, you're never alone. Your late mother is always there at your side. Is that because you reincarnated her as a demon? She's always looking after you, Aya. Okay, now please get to bed. Yes, father. Good girl. Father, tomorrow is, yes, the anniversary of her death. We'll visit her grave together. Okay. Now get to bed, please. I'll be resting too shortly. Okay. Okay, so let's examine the uh, facts. Or the clues we have here so far. Her dad is working alone in a basement. Wearing a mask, a surgical mask, and some beady eyeglasses. Not good. No! Ah, help me! Help! Oh, crap! Whoa! Whoa! What kind of work is your dad into? That, that, that doesn't sound too humane. I know father's secret. Well, please, share with us. My father is a scientist. He loves research and is always locked up in the lab in the basement. And I've always heard things from that lab. Animal and human screams. Even at a young age, I knew what my father was doing. So I pretended I wasn't looking. 
that I didn't know or anything. I feigned ignorance the whole time because I love Father. That's not the only secret I know. Whoa! You, your dad has multiple secrets? So far, he sounds insane. When Mom and I weren't around, he and his hope. What would they do? Kill people? Oh! A fine sample. I shall dispose of the remaining materials myself. That could wait. Come, Maria. She looks wicked. Doctor. Whoa. Whoa. Are they hugging? She's aware of our relationship. Holy crap. Wow, a soap opera this early on. I don't believe she's fond of me. That is the problem. The girl will be 11 soon. It's a troublesome age to be sure. Be kind to her, please. Make sure she is never harmed. She is my most precious. What? So, a 10-year-old girl is about to turn 11. She has a dead mother, a father who's insane and in a relationship with his helper, and they cut up animals and humans as research subjects. Okay, it's midnight. Today's the day Mom went to heaven. Mom, maybe she can give you some clues as to what's going on. I can never sleep when I think about Mom. Oh, quit, 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 sweet. Oh, cool, I used the arrow keys. Awesome. Your favorite teddy bear. What's this? A beloved doll. Ooh. A doll I got from father. It's so old and worn. Why am I reading this in an English accent? Or a poor English accent? I have no idea. So I looked at the doll and that cute cutscene. Ah, oh, flashback! Dad still looks insane. Look at his head. I bought you a present, Aya. Yay, it's the doll! Thank you, Father. What a pretty doll. It's almost like it's real. Oh, whoa, 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 it's real. It's a dead baby. It's a dead, dead baby. Call 911 on your father. We're all creeped out. A portrait of mother. Mom. Holy crap. What should I do, Mom? I don't know. I do love father, but... She scares me. She's always looking at me with those eyes. I hate her, but I know father likes her. If father and her got married, I guess she would She would be my new mom. I don't want her to be my mom. I don't want a new mom. There's only one mom in the world for me. Mom, why did you have to go? I don't think she went voluntarily. I think she was murdered. Who out there thinks the mom was murdered? Because I sure do. Holy crap, what's that? Something fell out. Is it a key? What's this? I got a gem. Awesome. Gems are hidden in various places. Some require doing special events to get. You can see your gem count in the menu. Find them all and... Something. How do I save? Is there like a save thing? I don't see one yet. What's this? Snowball, the pet rabbit. Is everything in here going to cue something? Mm -hmm. Can't complain. The room feels cold all of a sudden. I'm kind of scared. Should I get back to bed? I would suggest so. Let's get back to bed. Let's, let's get back in here and just sleep all our troubles away. Get back into bed. and Remember, if, it can, if, it, if you can't see it, it cannot see you. Remember that, everybody. That is the golden rule when it comes to nightmares, demons, and anything paranormal. If you cannot see it, it cannot see you. It's like the dad is crying. You sing so well, Aya. Was he playing the guitar or playing the drums? Maybe he's playing a bongo. Father, would you look this way? Give me a moment. Just put this here. Yes, it's finished. A wreath of flowers. A flower crown. Does it look good on me? Yes, I think it suits you well. Yay! Thank you, Father. I'm sorry I can't always play with you. 
Still trying to find the right voice for the father. Father? It's alright. I'm glad I could play with you today, father. Is that mother? Mother! You're not dead yet. Oh my. You two were playing. Mom! Give me a hug. I love you. Look! Father made me a flower crown. That's wonderful. It looks great to me, Aya. So you played with him all day? Yep. Sure did. And he's insane. You should see the pile of dead bodies behind the hill over there. We should do this again, Father. Yes, we should. Next time, your mother should join in. Well, I look forward to it. <coughs> Mom, I'm sorry. Just another fit. Heck, and wheeze. Don't push yourself if you're not feeling well. Come get some medicine from Maria. It should help you get better. No, I can get that myself. Mom, are you hurt? You're okay, right? So, to worry you, I'm perfectly fine. Sorry to worry you. I'm fine. Don't look so anxious, please. Aya, your smile keeps me going best of all. If I can't see you smiling, it only makes me worry. Mom. She... Okay, whew. Now, let's get back for dinner. I made hamburger steak tonight. Oh, sweet. I'm going to eat at your place. I love Mom's hamburgers. Right, Father? Haha. <laughs> Of course, her hamburgers are the best in the world, and I'll make hamburgers out of her. Ha 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 ha! I like the mother. We were so happy then. There was Maria, but even the even so, the three of us were a happy family. But then Mom passed away from illness, and the happiness we had then, well, got cut up into tiny little pieces, put in an oven, and <coughs> gone out the window. That's how she got the doll. The doll is the mother. I've solved the game. What was that? Huh? That scream, Father. Let's not go check it out. Don't go check on Father. I have a bad feeling. Well, I do too. All the internet has a bad feeling. What? What's going on? What's that sound? Is it a voice? Baby. Oh crap! Whoa! <laughs> Oh, you guys have got a little something all over you. No! No, don't. This way. Who's that? Come this way. Is someone there? See, this girl can run. Oh, sweet. A blonde-headed person. Please be someone that is, like, sane. Who are you? This way. Who? Stay with me. I said this way. Okay. All right. Whoa. 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 Okay. Guy with the top hat. All right. Top hat guy. Ooh, you look crazy. Many interesting books in this room here. Do you like books, my dear? Who are you? Now, don't be so aggressive. I'm merely a salesman. Salesman? You're bald. Call me. I hope to get to know you yet. Okay. But it's quite troublesome to think that corpses loiter around the house. Corpses? Those monsters back there? They're like monsters from a story. Why would monsters like that? Well, it's a curse. What you saw were the corpses of your father's test subjects. Overcome with anger, those deceased have been brought back by the power of a curse. To take revenge on your father, of course. What? So father is in danger? I have to save him! Why is that? To achieve his desires, he has killed so many people as part of his experiments. This is his retribution. You must have realized by now your father's true nature. And yet you wish to save him? Yeah, we're gonna test our luck with the corpses. My mom. Perhaps she cannot yet understand their sorrow. And we're going to take our luck with the corpses in the hall. Father was always kind to me. He's the only father I have. And I promised mom too. Okay, before we start the fighting with the monsters, I want to be allowed to save. I have to be allowed that. The red-eyed stranger gave Jack the power to curse others. And Jack said, Thank you, red-eyed stranger. Now can I get my revenge? Hey mom, 
Yes, Aya. What's father always up to down below? It's a very difficult job. You'll understand when you're older, Aya. I want to be older soon, then. Aya. Whatever happens, you shouldn't hate your father. Mom, what's the matter? Of course I wouldn't hate father. I see. Mom, do you not like father? No, nothing like that. I'm just like you, Aya. I love your father just as much. Whew! He can be a bit unpredictable. So let's support each other no matter what. Promise? Yeah. Now back to the story. Who reads their kid a story like that for bed? Honestly, that is not good parenting. For all the parents out there that are watching this video, why would you read a kid that story? Red-eyed monster, revenge. Why can't you read some like, like Jack and the Beanstalk, Peter Cottontail or something? I don't know. I don't, don't listen to me. Apparently, I'm, I'm crazy, and the guy in the basement chopping up people's not. So don't worry. I have to go save father. Uh, crow. Hello, Mr. Crow. Sweet. All right. Sweet. So I can save with the crows. I just we'll go just a little bit longer. Ooh, what was that? A row of pots. Nothing down there. Oh, Lord. Ooh, okay. Gotta run from the dead corpse. It's locked. Ooh. Okay, so you did the worm backwards. I applaud you. He can do the worm backwards. Sweet. That's awesome technique. Dude, you gotta teach me that. Oh, cool. Oh, creepy. Very creepy. Who are you? A mannequin doll? So detailed. It barely seems like a doll. It's a person! Okay, we got a gym. Let me... Alright, hold on. I'm just gonna check back up here and see if this curtain can be moved. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. The, this dolls. The dolls have a creepy smile. I imagine so, because they're dead people. Made to look like dolls. Why don't you listen to me? No one's ever going to listen. I guess I have to find the keys for these rooms. So I guess as I move, there's a lot of light that follows me. Hey, crow. Thank you. Thank you, Crow. Well, guys, this will be it for this episode here. I thank you for watching. If you like this game, if you want me to continue it, please drop a comment, like, subscribe, share with your friends, and I'll see you on the next episode of Matt Father.